any spades is lurking wants to know from you rick is there any info on t lopez and top rank going into litigation i haven't heard anything but there's i listen this guy is so crazy, this Tia Fimo. He doesn't listen to anybody that anybody tells him. He, he, he listens to the last person he talked to, and it's just terrible. And and, and he's, he's torpedoing his own career. He just sits out fights that are just dates because he can't get – he can't fight a particular guy or they want to fight a particular guy and he won't fight him or he wants too much money. He just doesn't – he just loses time. He's going to be one of those fighters that end up broke in, after a few, a few years after they retire. Why? Because he's, he's just so mentally unstable, you think? Or Yeah, it's part of it. Yeah. It's part of it. And he turns down fight dates. You can't replace that money. Yeah, like I know, um, I know you reported that he he uh turned down a top rank had a main event slot for him for for a Friday and he turned it down because it wasn't on a Saturday. Yeah, then he denied it. But it, but believe me, I, I checked with multiple people that that were involved. And they all told me he didn't want to fight on a Friday because he says it's not big enough fight date date. They say it looks like a club show. He wants to fight on a Saturday night. Well, I don't. I don't mean his last fight against Steve Claggett was basically a club show. So I don't. I don't see. What, 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 why he would turn it down? Because he's wacky. Yeah. It, 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 one day is this, one day is that. He's all over the board. He's a fucking screw. He's half a screwball. Yeah. Fuck it. He is a screwball. Why are you talking about half a screwball? He's a screwball. I don't know if you're allowed to, but um, who, who is Top Rank trying to get him to fight before, for that date? Do, do, uh, I'm sure you know. Okay. I don't, I don't remember it. I don't remember, to be honest with you. I wasn't really that concerned. All I know is he turned the fight down, said it was a Friday night, and, you know, come up with, you know, it was probably wasn't the right amount of money. He probably wanted more. He's just nuts. He, he he comes up with excuses not to fight. Yeah. It's unfortunate because, you know, he really, like, beginning of his career, he he, sh he shot out the cannon. He was he was ahead of all these guys when he beat Lomachenko and Komei and all these guys. And yeah. Not really getting yeah. He, he put himself exactly where he is. He's a world champion, but he's in the shed house. I know. Um, I know he was with the Canelo during the all fight week, and he's been training with him. You know, if 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 he is going to be with Reynoso and Canelo, how do you think that would that that'll go? Not too good because his father will be fucking involved, and in anything to do with that father is what he's 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 completely wacky. Yeah, I mean, I I still got love for a TFMO senior, but like uh, you know. Every time I see him, I've last four times I've seen him. Two times he wanna he wanna argue with me and and, and try to insult me. Cool, so like he's all over the place as well. You don't know on any given day. Well, they keep they keep saying they they keep saying they're from Brooklyn. Or oh, the, the team Feeble is not from Brooklyn. He's born in fucking he's born in like raised in South Florida. South Florida, and 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 for some reason he has this thing where he don't want to be from South Florida. But why why, why wouldn't you want to be from South Florida? It's a great place. That's right. Tax free state and 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 and, and the government's fucking Republican. You can't beat that. That yeah, and, and, and beautiful women and great weather and the, yeah, no 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 earthquakes. It's the beautiful. Earth, the best hockey team in the world. I mean, it, it list goes on and on and on. Yep, that's true. It's true. And and, and a football team it keeps getting beat by the Buffalo Bills gets their ass spanked every time they play the Buffalo Bills. <laughs> that too. Get get them spanked every time. How, 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 how about how, what is it with that? Buffalo, Buffalo. Every time they play Miami, they spank them. What's going on with that? I just think the Dolphins. The Dolphins are pretenders. I'm not. I, I'm not really a big football guy, but the Dolphins are. The, the Dolphins are the biggest pretenders in South Florida, and they always have been, and they always will be. So yeah, well, the Sabers. I mean, the the Buffalo Bills. They won twelve out of the last fourteen games against those bums. That's why that one, like last year when when the Dolphins actually wound up winning a game against them, it was like they won the Super Bowl. I remember everybody was celebrating around town like the Dolphins won the damn. Yeah, Super Bowl. that that was because of the heat. Yeah, remember how early it was in the season, the heat. Yep, yep. yep. And they know it. They yep. know it. But Rick, 